Hello everyone, welcome to the WP Carousel Pro plugin video tutorial series. Today I'm going to show you how to configure carousel settings like autoplay, navigation, pagination and more. Make sure the WP Carousel Pro plugin is installed and activated into your site. You can directly click on add new or you can click all carousels and then click add new to create a new carousel and give it a title. Before diving into the carousel settings features, let's create a carousel. I have added a few images, click show preview and you can see this is how the carousel is showing. Those are the paginations and those are the navigations. Let's hide the caption from the style settings first and now go to the carousel settings. First option is carousel orientation. Horizontal means the carousel will slide horizontally like left to right. On the other hand, vertical means the carousel will slide vertically like top to bottom. By default, the carousel plays automatically. If you turn this option off, then the carousel will not slide automatically. Configure the autoplay speed and sliding speed as you like. If you set the sliding speed value to 1000 instead of 600, then the carousel will slide slowly. Configure the pause on hover, infinite loop, carousel direction, carousel row and sliding effect. Below that you'll find the navigation and pagination related properties. You can show or hide the navigation from here. Select navigation position from several options. By default, the navigation position is set to vertically center. If I select it to top right and update the preview, then you can see the navigations are showing at the top right position. You can also change the navigation icon size. Set the navigation arrow color from here. So let's set the color to this one and hover color to this one. So now if I update the preview, then you can see the color has been changed. Let's get back to the default position. Check the box to hide the border and background. So this is the border and background around the navigation arrow. So if you want to hide this, then you can use this option. Configure border width, border style, color, hover color and radius from here. So if I set the border radius to 50% and update the preview, then you can see the border is showing as a circle. You can also change the navigation arrow background color and hover background color as well. Similarly, you can show head the pagination from here. Configure the pagination margin, color, slide to scroll. Slide to scroll means you can set how many items you want to scroll per pagination. If I set the value to 4 and update the preview and scroll it, you can see 4 items are scrolling at a time. That's all about configuring carousel settings like autoplay, navigation, pagination and more. In the next video, I'll come up with another attractive feature of the plugin. Until then, take care.